Hey everyone, I'm Grant Hall, and I figured that before I start my next Let's Play, I should do a short introduction for the people who may not have heard of this game, and explain the comment at the end of my last video about not being sure this game actually exists. You see, it all started back in August of 1991, when Nintendo Power ran a preview about an upcoming game by the name of Bioforce Ape. It was going to be one of the last games on the NES, and had a ridiculous premise, even for an NES title. They kept running previews every so often for the next few months. Sadly, in April of 1992, Nintendo Power announced that Bioforce Ape had been cancelled, and most people didn't think of it any further. Video game collectors, however, are not most people. Seta had apparently finished the game, which meant there must be a prototype copy of it out there somewhere. Collectors searched for years, YEARS, but to no avail. On October 26th, 2005, a thread was created on Digital Press, a forum for video game collectors, titled simply, BIOFORCE APE. The thread's creator, Paul B. 812 said that he had found an NES cartridge with a plain label just saying BIOFORCE APE at a garage sale, and posted several screenshots. Now at the time, Digital Press had an ongoing war over whether or not ROMs of rare games should be dumped so anyone with an emulator can play them. Hoarders argued that it ruined the collectible value of the game itself, while Wasters argued that it afforded everyone the opportunity to experience a piece of gaming history, and that it prevented the possibility of the game being lost forever. The Bioforce Ape thread became another battleground. As the arguments got more heated, the screenshots Paul was posting became more and more bizarre, eventually even seeming to reflect the war itself. Finally, fed up with all the fighting, Paul smashed the cartridge with a hammer. By that point, most people had realized it was a hoax. But it was such a popular hoax that members of the community decided to make their own Bioforce Ape homebrew NES game based on the screenshots and information Paul had released. Then, in March 2010, when the homebrew of Bioforce Ape was almost complete, a prototype Famicom cartridge appeared on a Japanese auction website. It was accompanied by a single photograph of a title screen. Frank Cifaldi, founder of Lost Levels, a website dedicated to tracking down rare games, won the game for $2,700, hoping against hope that it wasn't another hoax. When the cartridge arrived, the man who had offered to dump the ROM posted this picture. Fortunately for everyone, it turned out he was just having a little fun. The game had arrived intact and complete. I'm still not sure I believe it. So, let's get started. This is Bioforce Ape. Wow, I timed that really well. Uh, let's go. So, hey, why'd you push me off the roof like that, guy? Uh, so... That, that was kind of a long fall. Alright, so... In order to attack, I have to stop. This game has some weird momentum to it. Ah! <laughs> what?! Okay, I really like the sprites in this game. I... I'm really surprised at how animated the, uh, Bioforce Ape is. I don't like that there's that half-second delay between hitting jump and actually jumping. But, you know, I understand it's because it's part of the, you know, animation but it does make it a little bit more difficult than it should be, really. Um... Oh, look, an enemy's respawn. We all know how much I... Ah, what?! A... <laughs> Was that a boxer in a kangaroo pouch? This game is weird. Alright, so... Oh look, another B. So... That guy wasn't too difficult to take down. Oh. Okay, so I had to go over here. Gotcha. Ah, what?! So we've got... a couple of karate guys. Ow. Hey! Stop it! <laughs> if I hit down while running, I start to roll. That is great. 
Alright, so do I want to go down here now? Oh no, I have to swing. So the, the physics in this game are kind of weird. Like, I'm not going to... Let's grab that thing upside down. I, I'm not going to lie, the physics in this game are really weird. I mean, you guys have seen how quickly I get my momentum back after stopping to punch. Alright, so if I just jump straight up, I go straight up. Gotcha. Ugh. I'm trying to get on that one block platform. Ah, what? Oh. Okay. So do I want to go down here? Oh dear. Um... Seriously, I have no idea where I want to go. That's usually a problem. Hmm. Yeah, I'm lost. Not a feeling I particularly relish. Well, I'm somewhere new, so there's that at least. I can tell because I've never seen this guy before. So, I need to... No, no, that didn't work. Ugh. Yeah, momentum in this game is really wonky. And I cannot tell for the life of me what that guy was supposed to be. Like, everyone seems to be a half-human-animal hybrid. No idea what that guy is. Ah! Uh, there we go. That's what I wanted to do the whole time. Doing it again? Oh, hey! I can build up momentum walking into a wall. <laughs> That's silly. Why are you doing that backflip? I don't want you to do a backflip. What? Oh! That red thing is a block! Ha 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 ha! Ah, okay. So... There we go. Did I just heal? I guess I healed. Now I'm down here. Okay, so ice cream heals me. Good to know. And... Was he like part human, part ninja? Oh no! That person has crocodile legs. Like, look at that. That's... That's a crocodile's mouth. Or maybe an alligator. I can never remember what the difference is. I know one of them, their teeth stick out when they have their mouths closed, but I can't remember which one is which. I ain't any sort of biologist. I don't need to know that kind of stuff. Alright. So... Hey, I'm almost fully healed. What do you know? But seriously, where am I going? I don't know. <laughs> so... Ninjas. Oh, and look, it's a kangaroo. What's up here? Hmm. 
nothing of exceptional importance was up there. Alright. But now I get an elevator. What? <laughs> there we go. So, this is a thing. No! Oh, I just need to hold down the jump button. Okay. That makes this a lot easier. <laughs> Alright, so, second platform's over there, next one's over there. How far up do I need to go here? Do I need to knock that sumo guy off the roof? Same way he knocked me down? Because that would be kind of amusing. First level is, haha, revenge! Um... Those are mines. Okay, so I guess I need to get in this elevator now. <laughs> Bang against the walls. Oh, this game is weird. I can't understand why it never actually came out. That's a lie, I can absolutely understand why it never actually came out. Did it try to take me too high at first? Hey there, sumo guy. You will learn the power of professional wrestling! I, I suppose you kind of are a professional wrestler, though, aren't you? Yeah! What? What? So do I jump off now? Um... Hey! Oh, good! I saved one of the people. Yay! Um, ah! <laughs> I was about to say second stage next time. I'm still gonna say that. Second stage next time. For now, I'm Granhol. See you guys next time.